YouTube. Today I'm going to be talking to you about different types of clay. Um, this type of clay that I have here is a type of air dry clay. It's called cold porcelain. Um, this much in stores is about fourteen to eighteen dollars depending on what type of brand that you get. And I made this at home for I think maybe four to six dollars or even five dollars, you know, however much it took. Um, I really wasn't, um, you know, thinking about it, so I didn't really think do it. So, anyway, um, these are some objects that you can make your clay out of. Um, like this is a pecan. We have a pecan tree, um, right next to our house. So, I just, if I can stop dropping it, um, I just, I picked up one of these to show you that it's a good object to do for a beginner. And then these leaves um, are really good. Like just doing this is really cool. You can put it on a flower that you do or whatever. So these are some good objects to choose. Um, Alright, ceramic clay. This is a big thing that I do, which is ceramics. Um, I have it here in this container. These are, this is ceramic. It's just real nice and soft clay. Just work it a little bit and it'll get super, super soft. You know, this is some of the little detailed items you can do. I'm sorry about the light, guys. It's kind of yellow. Okay. And some of the finished products of ceramic clay um, would look sort of like this. Let me get up in front of the camera so I can see that you see it. This is a heart dolphin. This one is pink. This one is like a really dark green. I didn't know it was going to turn out that color. It's supposed to be a sea green, but as you see, it didn't turn out that way. Another one. This is a doe dough with deer, female deer. This is a buck and I made them to where that they would have their noses touching because I thought it was really cute. Um, unfortunately they didn't stay like that because the person that put them in a kiln separated them. Eh, whatever. They're good by themselves too. And then this is a Christmas tree or a pine tree that has a little stand on it. Um, the reason they don't have glaze on the bottom, by the way, is because when you put it in a kiln, uh, it cannot have any glaze on the bottom or it will stick to the rack that it is fired on. Um, this one has a stand, but these two, their stands broke off, so now they're just like sad trees. <laughs> um, so, I'll have those. And then this one I made is super, super amazing. Well, it was amazing. Until it broke. Yeah. Um, it broke because I accidentally dropped it. Uh, when I was coming out of the building, the leaf came off too. Uh, poor leaf. And, um, this color is a very bright leafy green. This one is called lilac. And inside it has a yellow, um, whatever it's called. And the bottom of this is just like a chocolatey brown. It's called milk chocolate. Uh, as you can see why. <laughs> okay. And, um, this is some of the stuff that I've been working on. Um, this is almost bone dry. Bone dry is when it's ready to go into the kiln. This is a stegosaurus. That took time, by the way. This is a cute little cartoon owl. It's kind of blurry. Can't really see. Eh, whatever. But it's. T <gasps> oh no! See, when it's bone hard, you're not supposed to touch it because I just broke its wing off. Whoops. Just gonna have a broken wing. I'll fix you later. 
and this one is a turtle. That is my symbol. There we go. Those are some bone bone hard. This little container has some slip in it, which is water and clay mixed together. It's like a glue in ceramics that holds all your pieces that you need to do together. This is a uh, paint stir that I used to make my slip with, stir it all together and stuff, but I eventually just put my hands in there and, you know, whatever. <laughs> um, this is a cup that I put my water in. It's a regular plastic cup. I have my paint stir, a wooden dowel. It's just a thing that I found in my room. Um, it's just a piece of wood that's rounded off to make good eyes. A spork from Popeyes. Woohoo! Fried chicken. <laughs> um, that I was putting my slip into, but now it's sort of like a tool. That's why it's all clay like. Some napkins. And a toothpick sticking out of it. <laughs> and then inside you can see where a little bit of the clay is still in there. Okay. And I keep all of this pretty much neat, uh, as neat as clay can be. Um, but yeah, that's it.